Hello everyone, this is Direwolf20, and today's video is on a couple different types of generators. Um, so far you've seen the standard generator. Um, I'm also doing a video on nuclear reactors. Uh, you guys will see that shortly. But first I want to cover uh, some of the other generators that are available here in Industrial Craft. So why don't I grab myself a wrench and uh, knock these standard generators off here. And I'll get to building a couple other items for you. So the first thing we're going to do is want to macerate some coal here, and that's going to get us some coal dust. We're going to want to take a generator, and some coal dust, and some glass, and I think we need some cables here. Ah, uh, no, I reversed for the glass, and there we go. Solar panels. Solar panels are a very nice device, and it's actually the one that I prefer to use the most. Um, so let's take a look at how they work. If I place my solar panel right here, first off, it needs to be able to see the sun. So, yep, good. If we right click on the solar panel, we'll see that there's a little yellow sum symbol here, basically saying that it can see the sun. And if it can't see the sun, like uh, it's shaded, So basically, if there's a block above it, and it doesn't even have to be directly above, um, you know, let's go two blocks above. That also counts as being covered. So it needs a direct line of sight to the sky in order to be uh, active. Lights are on. That's good. How much energy does this guy produce? Well, I'm going to be honest with you, it's not a terribly large amount. One energy unit per tick. And the thing is that at night time, this is the equivalent exchange item, by the way. Once we get to night, the solar panel turns off. And we are once again producing zero energy units per tick. But when the lights turn back on from the sun, thank you, watch of flowing time. one energy unit per tick. So, there you go. Uh, that's the solar panel. Um, what I like to do is build what's called a solar flower. There's actually quite a few uh, recipes online for building uh, solar panels and different kinds of solar arrays. Here's the one that I kind of like. Um, that should be enough, I would hope. Now we want our bat box here. We want the output to be down, remember. This is just my way of getting the bat box to face down. So there we go. Output is facing down now, which is good. And then I'm going to basically put some copper cables on either side, including the top. The top one's optional, I just like the way it looks. And then build out on every edge of the copper cables a solar panel. This is a solar flower design that existed in version 1 of um, Industrial Craft, and it works just fine in Industrial Craft version 2. I think it looks nice. Ah, look how nice that looks. If you counted, I used 13 solar panels, so I'm getting, you guessed it, 13 energy units per tick. So once this guy evens out here, we'll see it's hovering around 13. Um, you're definitely going to want to make sure you've got a um, storage unit of some kind hanging out right next to your cabling, because if we extended this cable one or two more blocks, you'd start to have energy loss. So that's solar panels. You can build all kinds of solar panel designs.